morning guys my goodness it's a bit chilly willies today a little bit chilly blue sky but it's cold it's 9 25 in the morning i'm up i'm dressed i've got a bit of makeup on my face i'm going to reflexology this morning and then uh we're off to the old for a few days so uh i'll collect some footage and stick it all together and stick it up on tinterweb Goodness, I've just had about 55 minutes of reflexology on my feet. Incredible, I don't know if you've ever had it. So apparently I'm <laughs> very stressed. Definitely need to work on my stress levels and mindfulness and all that sort of stuff. It was relaxing, but then some of it was just not relaxing. So, you know, as, you, as they're massaging your feet, and it's not just massage, it's like pressing into points and that sort of stuff. Some of it's really like oh, tender, which is quite interesting. And also parts of your feet respond to part, different parts of your body. So it was really interesting. And I'll definitely go back. Um, she was lovely, really, really nice lady. She said she could have worked on my feet for hours. <laughs> I, was, I was like, oh, okay, that's not good, is it? She said you just needed it. Need they needed a lot of work. I think she thinks it's pretty much all sort of that I just hold everything in really, and I'm, I'm you know, proper kind of stiff up a lip, carry on, but I probably don't really deal with stuff just bury it and move on but I don't really know how not to bury it and move on you know you don't want to be like a you know a wreck every day crying into your pillow do you I will definitely go back and um, yeah see if it helps me in the long run but for now I need to go home tidy up pack my bag and um, poodle off to the Alps so hopefully that'll be relaxing. Fingers crossed. Right, packed, ready to go. Got my water, got my sarnies. Yeah, I have one of these right now, so I'm starving. I do like snowdrops. So this is looking a bit dead still. <laughs> and I love these too, these um, really nice. I'm going to vlog you getting your vegetable box. <laughs> really? Yes. Picking up the milk here, just the veggie no, no, box. We, we get the veggies and the milk. Oh, here. right. Yeah, we get it all here. Everything's here. Um, we'll have to call you Eco Mummy from now on. An Eco Mummy? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go get the box. The Eco Box. Eco Mummy Eco Box. That's where you get your milk from. I wish we had one of these. Yeah, it's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. 
Wow, so these are all the orders. Everybody's. Do you all get the same veg? No, no, no. Oh, well, yes, you basically get the same depending on your size. So this is me. Mm -hmm. I have a small one. And we've got some kale, spinach. Um, well, there's a lot of leaves there. That's, oh, <laughs> that's broccoli tops. All oh, right, you don't need to buy any. No, no, bugs. Brussels sprouts. Oh, I thought you were going to say bugs in there. Brussels. Then we've got celery, parsnips, and carrots. Nuts. Lovely, muddy things. <laughs> Potatoes. Potatoes. Onions. Fab. Fab. There we are. That's, that's brilliant. Fab. And then you bring your box back and you put it in that pile. Return my it gets box recycled. We'll go and see if there's anything tempting us in the, um, the shop. In the shop. The veg shop. Right. So, what have we got? There's salad. Is that salad? Oh, yeah, that's the salad. Oh, yes, we've got a salad. Anyone? Yeah, they'll all be fine. Yeah. The empties. Empties. Is this yogurts and milks and. Yogurt, milk, cream. Right, here we are. Right. One whole milk, one semi skinned, one yogurt, and one mm -hmm. cream. <laughs> Yummy. Delicious cream. Delish. We supply mm -hmm. fruit. Eco Mum. It's <laughs> collected her Eco bits. Eco Warrior. Her wares. Yes. And now we go to Delicatessen <laughs> and pick up some something else. Fruit. No, no. Fruit. Delicatessen. Fruit shop. Let's go. Oh. Eco Mum on a fruit mission. Ooh, funky music. Right, my mum is famous and my dad. So they went on holiday, when was it, a couple of years ago? Last year. Last year. Last year. We did the Greek project and they did a um, food, typically, food <laughs> tour, <laughs> where you learn to cook some Greek food. And look, they're in the brochure. ta -da! Look, they're famous. Did mum give you them? Did mum give me those flowers? Yeah. No, I gave them to mum. <laughs> I know. I'm joking. They're very nice. Even a pan scourer in it. It's had a little little message in here. You see, mm. little message. You see, saying yeah. what's for dinner. Uh, it said, <laughs> "As words cannot alone express how much I love you, I hope these flowers will help." Aww. All my love, Brian. Oh, it's nice, isn't it? Your romantic thing, you. <laughs> oh, they're lovely. Right, I've got to set the table. Recording. Blogging! <laughs> You're not going to blog that to anybody, are you? Might do. You're a danger. <laughs> they love you. You better say hello to your fans. They love you. Greetings, fan. <laughs> Who, which fans? <laughs> my subscribers. <laughs> oh, my goodness me. I know they love you. I don't know why. No, no, I wonder why. I no can't idea. imagine. But they do. Oh. Hi, fans. <laughs> Mm -mm. Got a banana. Then Charlie. Then Charlie. Eco mummy style. Perfect carbonara. Mm. Bucatini. <laughs> That's for the gin and tonic. Okay, we'll do that now. <laughs> mm. 
Right. Didn't you put in oil before? No. Oh yes, yeah, of course you got it. Oh god, yeah, I forgot. I should have put that. I should have put that in first. Oh my god. Oh, I'll be fine. It'll all be fine. Just mix it all together. It's all gonna get mixed in the stomach. Yeah, it's all gonna get mixed in the pan. Oh yes. Come with me. The pasta. The pasta is it coming. Sorry about the pan. Don't care. It's authentic. It's authentic. Yeah, it certainly is authentic. Yummy, yummy. Yum. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, still at my mum and dad's. Only uh, leaving tomorrow. So I've got my <clears throat> new makeup of tea. Look, earplugs. Earplugs, because my dad, who is next door, snores like a walrus. <laughs> so I have to put the earplugs in. Anyway, he didn't snore all that much last night, so that was good. We're off to Warwick and Leamington Spa to do some family history. So um, we won't be able to vlog too much of that, but um, eh, might have a little montage or something. So, um, yes, up and at them. This is the view this morning. It looks a little overcast. <laughs> a little, as in, can't see any blue sky at all. But hopefully that'll burn off. Hopefully. And it looks, I don't know, a bit damp, I suppose. Can you hear the birds? Ooh, I don't know what that was. We've made it to the first port of call on the family history tour. It's a churchyard. We're just about to meet some relatives. My great, great grandmother? Is it my great-great-grandmother, this, or...? This is your great-great-grandmother. Great-great-grandmother. Let's go say hi. We're trying to find the grave. Oh gosh, it might be unmarked. Um, Connell. See, there's a lot of graves that have lost their gravestones, um, or they've fallen over, so difficult. Gorgeous snowdrops. Yes, aren't they nice? Really lovely. <sighs> we found him. Found him. This is <laughs> Edward. I think. Really yeah, cute. Edward. Hang on, let's get it. Smith. Cleaned up a bit. Uh, is there any more of those? Something. Day? His. His. Husband. Husband. Maybe on the other side there might be yeah. more. Yeah. Oh, man. Great great granddad. Actually, your great great grandfather was married to your great great grandmother. Oh, we are now walking to find great grandma's house, my mother's grandma's house, where she lived as a child up until 19. Yes, yeah, yeah. did she live here? Yes, yeah. it's all very confusing. <laughs> That's it, that's where my great grandmother lived until the age of 19. So this is part of the asylum where great-grandmother worked, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Uh, it's now Swanky Flats. <laughs> Not that I'd want to live in one of them. No. So this is part of the building that my great-grandmother worked in, in the asylum. Mental institution, they used to call them, I suppose, in asylums. Luckily she worked and she wasn't a resident, although it could explain quite a lot. Cracking view. Gosh, look at that. 
So we think this is the actual asylum. I think this bit. is the actual asylum. That's the batty house. <laughs> yeah. Where she would have worked, maybe. Probably. So what was the other bit then? Do you think the sanatorium ah. and the children's? So there's obviously a children's hospital yeah. here. But this is the scary bit. Yeah. The, uh, the asylum. Yeah. This is like the Wild West, look. <laughs> Horses on the road, on the roundabout. So that's oh, dead you end. Take, you take anything you do. People like to see this kind of weird stuff. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Including you. And you're the most Hello. weird of all. It's me again. I'm trying. We have now arrived at a lock. Hatton lock? I don't know. It's got a lot of locks. <laughs> and a lot of locks. What are you doing taking a break? <laughs> I'm showing them that we have to share the toilet. <laughs> All right? Ridiculous. No, we have to share the toilet. So we're in a... <laughs> I already said that is locked. But thank you for your input. Can we say that through here? No. Oh, look. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I can see you. Christmas tree ready for next year. Nice. Tonight we're having duck with noodles and broccoli and stuff. Peppers, chilli sauce you didn't you and all that fish, jazz. Did you, <laughs> Homemade meringues, cream, fruit. Hello Martin, have you seen all this? It's not Martin, it's my oh. vlog. <laughs> God. <laughs> well you've made a right mess of yours, that's, that's not how not. to do it. Mine was much better, look. Yeah, it's done. Ta -da! Achieved. Looks exactly the same. In fact, mine looks a jolly sight better. Yeah. Mine With wins. organic. Mine wins. Cream in the middle. Mm. Oh, God. Yum.